Welcome to the... Hey, Stewie, uh, look, something came up. I'm not going to be able to do the picnic today. Oh, oh, was that, was that today? Oh, yeah. Oh, no, no way I can make that either. I'm, I'm, I'm canceling too, man. <laughs> wow, good memory, though. I, I totally blanked on that. Stewie Griffin! My God, Bertram! But how is this possible? I, I killed you! You only killed me in this universe, you fool! Oh, so you got yourself a multiverse remote, huh? Indeed I did! Wait, ho hold on. Will someone please tell me what the hell is going on here? <sighs> Sorry, hang on one sec. You remember the multiverse theory? Yeah... It's the one about how there are alternate universes that coexist with ours on parallel dimensional planes. So, in each of these universes, the reality is different from our own. Sometimes only slightly, sometimes quite radically. This Bertram is from a universe where we never killed him. Okay, okay, I think I got it. Sorry, not a genius. Now, what do you want? Well, I can't possibly allow a universe to exist without me in it. I'm traveling the multiverse, building up an army to exact my revenge on you. When I return, I'm going to destroy your universe completely. See you soon, Stewie. Ryan, ah! <laughs> this is bad. With a cross-dimensional army, he'll have no problem destroying our universe. Who knows what he's going to bring back here? Well, what are we supposed to do? We have to try and stop him before he can organize his attack. All right, Brian, we're going to need to arm ourselves. I'm sure he knows we're going to come after him. His armies are going to be waiting for us every step of the way. You think... You think maybe I can use one of your ray guns? No, I get Stewie weapons, you get the boring stuff. That's what we're doing. Fine. But how are we going to find him? He could be anywhere, right? Luckily, I just updated my multiverse remote, so I have tracking software now. We'll be able to follow every move he makes. Hang on, Bry. We're going back to the multiverse. What the hell? Wait a minute, Brian, this isn't where we were supposed to go. What do you mean? I don't know, the remote's not working for some reason. You know, everyone said, get on the cloud, it's going to be great. And everything's been a nightmare since. Well, can you fix it? I don't have the proper tools. But maybe we can find someone who does. All right, well, can you at least find out where we are? According to the multiverse remote, this is a universe ruled by Greeks. So, what does that mean? Fat, hairy philosophers in togas or fat, hairy greaseballs in speedos? Oh, yeah, Greeks have always been gross and still are. But no, it's not those kinds of Greeks, Brian. It's worse. It's frat boys. Hey, those guys aren't like us. Get those knob gobblers. Crap, Brian, run! We have to find someone to help us fix my remote! What's a knob gobbler? You'll understand when you're older. Come on, Stewie, we gotta find someone who can fix the remote. The next five hours, you're my bitch. 
वाह मुझे इस तरह के गांड बच्चे बड़ी बुरी लगते हैं जो अपनी उम्र से बड़े होते हैं आई एट दैट काइंड ऑफ बेबी Hey you two, do you want to pledge to our fraternity? Here's a Torah and some bacon to rub on your face so you break out. This might sound a little odd, but do you know if there's like an electronic store or a creepy Armenian guy in a dimly lit apartment who can fix a multiverse remote? Oh, I can help you get that fixed, but I'll require a service in return that's worth more than the service I'll be providing you with. We need you to help our fraternity throw a better party. We've been standing around complaining for hours, but that doesn't seem to be a party to the Gentiles. Here's some ammo. Now go shoot those lame balloons down. Oh, wait until I put my earplugs in. This party's lame. I think there's someone throwing up over there just because they're nervous. Yatters? Really? What are we, twelve? I'm feeling lightheaded. I wish life was turn-based like my role-playing games. I love piñatas. I shall kill you. Ryan, I don't like it here. All these Jewish kids sadden me. All right, Pry, here's the deal. Only one of us fighting at a time. Think of it like tag team wrestling. When you get hurt or too tired, tag out. Good, you shot all the balloons. Now, oh look, there's a sorority girl running down the street. I bet her dad's so rich. Dude, wait until my bros see these nasty pictures of you. Hey, get back here with those. I was gonna wait one more year before I leak naked pictures of me online. You should go talk to that sorority girl and see what's the matter. Also, ask her how much her dad has in his retirement fund. Let's go and talk to sorority girls. Chalo chalte hai sorority girls se baat karte hain ki kya majra hai. I'm afraid to be out this way. Oh my god! That scumbag stole pictures of me and my sorority sisters. I'll pretend to like whoever gets them back. Recover Lisa's picture. Okay, got it. Nice nips. Wow. Someone should buy her a razor. I'd say she's a low seven. Get those guys. They're with the nerds. Please, sir. I want some more. How does it feel to buy your friend? Now I won't feel bad about crapping my pants. I'd bang that when I'm blacked out. 
You want the pictures? Come and get them. I already yanked it to them anyway. These two dorks just won't quit. Come on, let's just be bros. Okay, bro? Fire your guns without ammo. I think that boy in the pool is dead. No, Stewie, he's just swimming. You see, college is all about having fun. Nope, he's dead. No one's helping him. those pictures. You should try to find more of them so you have material to shamefully touch yourself to at night, or even very early in the morning. Now, I got a keg, but didn't want to put the deposit down for the tap. Would you find one for me? Oh, I think that house over there has one. Let me know if you guys want to drink with me. I can always use your companion. Hey, it's those douchebags who stole the pictures of us. Oh my god, oh my god, I am Whoever so kills those guys gets right now. Now. It's weird, like one side of my face is like numb, the other side just like... Bye-bye, tramp. And can anyone stop Stewie Griffin? It's anarchy. I guess this is what happens when douchebags become way too entitled. We gotta stop them. if we don't. Uh, hey. I'm already semi there. I smell death on you. Now, where's that one white girl with my coffee liquor? Big freak.
Frag out! I'm angry, but not because I'm gay. Well, I can't take all the credit. There's some loser moving his thumbs around and pushing buttons, so, you know, that helped too. What do you say to that? Delightful. Listen, honey, after what happened to you tonight, you wouldn't want to wake up tomorrow anyway. Open your mouth Dad. and close your eyes. Mm -hmm. Get ready for a big Except surprise. She finds out about this. I come bearing a gift. I'll give you a hint. It's a what night you guys and the nerd not a toaster. No! everything on you. Now we need some women to come to this party. Oh, I got a crafty idea. Listen, I need you to steal a couple of jackets from the jock crack. Bring them back here and I'll tell you what to do next. Hey, that tap's mine. I stole it from someone else. You wreck me in the rec room. Oh, Come on, you guys. I put deodorant on. Everyone. What do we say, boys? No, no fat chicks! Let me in. All my other friends said they died. I'm gonna puke. Hell did Stewie do to this place? Dude, oh. don't let that chick in. Let me the oh. Oh. Yeah, Dude, take a bong rip. Watch out, Will. Give it up, Brian. Burn in hell! Oh. Get ready to die, you dick. The next five hours, you're my bitch. thing. Once some more. Hey, who 
Go get a bucket of water, folks, because this kid is on fire. Don't you burn in hell! Oh. How positively delightful! All right, shh. Let sleeping douches lie. Bring it on, bitch! This is my rifle, this is my gun, this is for fighting, this is for fun! So what if it's small? Not my fault, I was born that way. Dude, get off! Guns without ammo. Uh, nice. Ow. Hey, can I hit that? Miss. Are we laughing at Brian? Ah, uh, Brian, you suck. Well, well, well. Get those cables! Piss on your carpet? Because I will. That's not your property, man. A little more. Shut the hell up. Great, you got the jackets. Now listen, Brian. Here's a Molotov cocktail. You need to plant those jackets by the Sorari's float, then set the float on fire. The girls will think the other frat did it, and then they will come to our party. I do it, but I feel, I feel a cold coming on. Come back here when you're done. But take your time, I'm gonna take an eight hour nap. Who builds floats? This is a weird college. anymore, so fill me up, fellas. <laughs> oh, you want me to piss on your carpet? Because I will. When you open your dreams, I'm already semi you there. For real. Unacceptable. Well, who are we kidding? You haven't made any progress. 
Well, don't have the guts to respond. They're huh? wrecking our crappy parade floats. What are you doing? They're wrecking our crappy parade floats. I am too smart. Screw off. You're just gonna sleep with me, and Ryan. Tell Use your Molotov cocktail to destroy the float and put the jackets there so we can frame the other frat. Well, if you want to be a hero, right now might be a good time. Any of you boys ever finish on a C-section, Scar? Tell me that's not epic! Brian should contribute a little You have to destroy the fl Ew, that thing is so tacky. I okay, you can stop that now. Please promise me you'll walk my tiny annoying dog. Ah! Oh, oh, you you got me. Reload, you dick. I'm a nasty squalid little hobo. Um, I think this diaper is going to need to be swapped out too. I'm already. Aw, oh, you suck. How positively delightful! What parade was this for? Who builds floats for parades in college? What is this, 1956? So now you'll never sleep with me. Please, sir. I want some more. Screw these guys. Let's go to the nerd party. They don't have the balls to do something like this. I need someone for the next five hours, you're my bitch. I shall kill you. You haven't made any progress. Brian, over here. I need someone to talk to. I can't believe those jocks wrecked our float. We should just, like, get pregnant with their babies. Brian, I've never tapped a keg and don't really want to. Please do it so I don't get hurt. Lucky lady. Good job getting the girls in beer, but we can't hear the music even without hearing aid and turn all the way up. The house across the cul-de-sac has some speakers. Go steal those. But don't say my name if you get caught. <laughs> Stewie, come on. You don't know how to use that thing. Oh, really? What if I hold it sideways like a black guy? Let's get speakers from that house. Their party has music. will come. Well, well... Ah, dude! Chill out! Clearly you need my help. Is that all you got, man? Ah, dude, get it. off! How positive and delightful! How positive and delightful!
Hey, let us in your party, you turds. Let us in, you schmucks. I think the nerds are in trouble. Come on, Brian, let's help them. I mean, I mean, yeah. shall yet be mine. Seconds. Check out my packs. Come on, man. You want to get stupid? No. Okay, okay, oh, yeah. I've got it. I've got it. Oh. You're oh, entering a world of pain. Sort of dialogue here. Oh. Uh, the breakfast thing. <laughs> to wrestle. <laughs> yeah. Piss off. Hold on to something. thing. Hey, where are you off to? Are you thinking what I'm thinking?
boy, good. You got the speakers. Here you go, and thank you guys so much. Now I have the whole night to fear the sex that I'll probably check it out of. Hey, no problem. Thanks for fixing the remote. Oh, fellas, I almost forgot. Some of the other nerds uploaded a new program on your remote. It analyzes your surroundings and gives you hints of what you should be doing on your journey. Hey, I'll be popping up now and then with objectives and little hints if y'all get stuck. And if you's in the mood, I can tell you where all the best farmer's markets is. Bye. Okay, we'll get to that later. We have to go, Bry. Bertram's already got a head start on us. Okay, now how exactly does a party work? Do we just take Alka-Seltzer and burp into our fists? Well guys, that's the end of level 1 of the Family Guy. If you like my videos, so please like and subscribe it right now. Good evening, Kohog. I'm Tom Tucker. Can a woman really be mayor? Or will she just...